welcome back to a, another video feature of the Immersive Worlds Handbook. I am outside the uh, Triennial Design Museum in Milan, and I had a chance to uh, stumble across yet another part of the uh, World Expo Milan 2015, and that is the um, Arts and Food, Arts and Foods Rituals. I'm taking side here, and this this ended up being a really fascinating journey into uh, food and rituals, uh, Italian and otherwise. Um, quite a remarkable find here in the city, which was uh, available if you had a, a ticket to the exhibition. So let me show you around some of the sights and, and sounds of this exhibit. Okay, and we begin the tour here, and I'm not going to show you everything um, from the exhibit. It was a very extensive space. Um, but basically the artwork and the material culture here are focused on all aspects of eating and food and patterns of consumption associated with it as well. The curious thing, and I'll show you the beginning and um, ending of this video, but you walk through this space that was uh, entitled Kitchen and Invaders, and it sort of had a combination theme of looking at the typical household accoutrements that we have, as you can hear from some of the sound here, it's quite dramatic, these alarms, and then uh, combining uh, that with this uh, theme of, uh, you know, space invaders, alien invaders. Okay, and I'll come back to that video in just a second, and I'm going to show you um, beyond this then a little bit what I noted before um, that part of the um, exhibit. So throughout the um, space here in Milan, they had all sorts of um, cooking uh, accoutrements, as you might expect, um, recreated bars, uh, like this, um, you know, really uh, an amazing space. And for me, what was exciting about this part of the expo, even though it was far away from the expo, you certainly did have to uh, travel um, a ways to uh, visit it, but your ticket actually was good for entrance. And you can see what they've done here. The curators have created a space that is uh, very much going along and, and I think creating a dialogue with the uh, main themes of the World Expo. And this was one of many interesting and curious uh, conceptual approaches uh, to art. And I'm sorry I don't, I don't have a lot of the titles of the artists here, um, but um, as you can see with my images, this was a, uh, a cart, uh, like a typical uh, food cart you might see in parts of Europe but it had um, all the markings of McDonald's and as you can see some other interesting and controversial imagery. Um, so you know what was exciting to me about this space was the fact that there was more room for contemplation and thinking about things in a conceptual sense. There certainly was artwork present in many of the pavilions at the World Expo site in Milan. Um, Slovakia certainly comes to mind and a lot of what happened at the South Korean pavilion I think also rose to that level of conceptual art. But I think the fact that you were allowed to just um, walk and slowly ponder the very, um, as you can see from the halls here, very much not a crowded space. So it was kind of exciting to be able to uh, visit this and to just really take in and reflect on all the various um, aspects of food and consumption that in tandem with the expo, I think, made for me as a, as a visitor for a very uh, intriguing dialogue about food consumption and uh, also the big issues of conservation that were so key um, at the expo space proper. And again, as I stated earlier, there was a lot more here than uh, what I was able to present in this video, but I wanted to give you a taste of uh, what this space was like. So let's conclude then. I'll take you through a walkthrough with the audio included of the very curious uh, Kitchen Invaders uh, conceptual art space.
in der vollautomatisierten Küchenzelle sind sämtliche Küchengeräte von einem Schaltpult I hope you enjoyed this video feature today here at Arts and Foods in Milan at World Expo 2015 and please come back for additional video features of the Immersive Worlds Handbook.